Hey, it's tea time. So this week's topic is on um, chance trending. I guess do we think it's a trend or not? You know, I actually think that's kind of unfair to say uh, to judge uh, whether or not a person is transgendered and if it's just becoming the cool thing to do. Um, I guess I guess there are places for a trend. You know, a fashion is definitely a trend. Um, I know in high school, one of the huge things was um, to be straight edge. Uh, I think that was a trend. <laughs> um, I don't know. I mean, there are definitely places for trends, whether it be clothes or hair or jewelry um, or hobbies. Um, but I honestly, I don't, I can't say that I would see transitioning as a trendy thing to do. I think if anything transitioning has just become a lot more of a viable option and a, a more of an open and more of a better known topic or resource now. I think before it wasn't really something that was talked about. I think when it comes down to it, it's always just been the binary genders. You have males and you have females. And, you know, for a long time, the same thing went with sexual orientation. You have um, straight and you have gay. <laughs> um, and it's just not like that. I mean, you would think that we would have grown out of these kind of uh, narrow categories, but we really haven't. And I think being transgender is actually kind of taboo still. Um, but I think that the reason it might seem like it's more prominent is because of the internet um, and social media as a whole there's just a lot more access to information that wasn't necessarily readily available and easy to access. Um, communication as a whole has just changed and grown uh, so vast. So I think that's one thing to keep in mind. I think another thing too though is that there's definitely always going to be a kind of a soul searching. I don't think anybody 100% fits in these categories. I feel like gender is so fluid and sexuality is so fluid that it can change and that it um, it it develops and and falls into these kind of gray spaces and uh, when it comes to being either male or female, it's just not necessarily the case anymore. Like, I don't, I don't think it's fair for people to say that, hey, you're transitioning because you know that's that's what you think is cool. That's what's going on right now. You think that you know maybe. Uh, you assume that because, you know, these ten guys over here, you know, have transitioned because, you know, maybe you relate to maybe like two of the same uh, topics that they might have talked about or maybe you share some of the characteristics that you think, oh, hey, uh, I'm transgendered, I need to transition too. I mean, when it comes down to it, aren't we all just trying to find a place where we're comfortable, where we can feel like we are seen as how we want to be seen. Don't we want to be comfortable in our bodies and comfortable in, in social circles and just uh, everyday life? I mean, it's kind of like anything else. I mean, Sometimes you just have to try it, 
in order to know whether or not it's for you, whether that means start dressing in men's clothes or start binding or maybe start going by male pronouns, um, start using, you know, prosthetic devices or, you know, whatever it is, you're kind of, you're experimenting in it, you know, and some people are going to take it further than others and some people need a full transition and some people don't and some people struggle with different dysphorias when it comes to parts of their body and uh, how they're observed and things like that so I mean I can't say that it's a trend I just think is it really our place to judge and to bash on them for transitioning and um, I, I know there's definitely probably a kind of animosity toward people that aren't really trans and they detransition and I know that can kind of make uh, the community seem a little bit um, I guess invalidated but I mean the same goes for someone who claimed they were gay and then all of a sudden they marry the opposite sex I mean it's like that's like anything <laughs> Um, so that's my take on gender trending. Um, I guess, uh, we'll see what everybody else thinks. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you later. Take care.